Hello and welcome to the fifth episode of this Youth Academy Challenge here in Belgium with Wakara Thames. As can be seen from the league table, we haven't been doing uh, very well in the league. We've played 15 matches so far, we've only won 4, we drew 2 and lost 9. And we are in 12th place, so at the moment we are in the relegation playoff. If we have a look at the Becker van Bergen, in the third round we came against RC Boysford and we won 5 0. In the fourth round we came against Poké Varfuse and we won 2 1 away from home. And in the third match we were knocked out in the fifth round by Liers 2 0. Now let's have a look at the squad. Our most consistent player has been Hani El Matkari with 7.3. Then comes Justin Ben Omar, 7.04. And third is Alec Luix with 6.97. As regards to goals, our top scorer has been Kevin Daman, 6 goals from 11 appearances. And close second has been Hani El Matkari with 5 goals from 16 appearances. As regards to assists, we have Habib Kwame, who is a youth player graduate. He has 5 assists from 17 appearances and tied in with Mohamed Yali, also on 5 assists from 15 matches. And close to this, Hani El Matkari, 4 assists from 16 appearances. Let's also have a look at how the youth graduates are doing this season. So we have Habib Kwame who has played 17 games, 5 passes so far, and rating of 6. He has been developing quite well and he's our starting fullback at the moment, our starting left. Then we have Maxens Angui, who is a central defender and has played 11 games, rating of 6. He's also developing quite well. The second central defender is Ludovic Mertens. He played 10 games and has a rating of 6.24. Then we have Wesley Roland. He this season played 6 games so far. 4, 2 and 1 assist with a rating of 6.76. He's, he's also developing very well. Almost 2.5. Then we have Juan Balofombo. Has only played 3 games so far, but 9 substitutions. He has 1 assist and 6.62 as a rating. We have also lost two of our best players from last season. Siron Wild, who has decided to join Winkel Sport. Actually, they are in the RSC Class B, so obviously uh, it was an improvement for him. The in division in Belgium. He joined on a free. We also lost Gilles van Moorzeke, who decided to join Virton. For 115k. Actually, he was quite unhappy, so he decided to move on. And unfortunately, Virton are one of our opponents in the RST National. We also got 50% uh, from next sale, so if it's sold, we will get another 50%. So hopefully, it will work in our favor. So, without further ado, let's go to the top. Five goals that have been scored in the offline games until today's game against URSL Visa.
I hope you have enjoyed those top 5 goals from our previous games. And now we'll go to the live game against URSL Visa. If we manage to beat Visa today, we will go above them in the table and at least we'll move out of the relegation zone. So I'm going to line up Espelos, Spezo in goal, with me at the back are Ayrt, Verbis and Tangui. We have Kwame and Lokando as wingbacks. In the middle of the park we have Ermat Kari and Ben Omar. We have an advanced playmaker of Wix. We have Roland as our sugar striker. And Daman as our advanced Let's go. Yes, Roland for the goal of the season. Second goal, Lekando has first of the season. The middle of the 25 minutes already. Come on, Espresso. This is so safe.
Good pass, the man, come on. I'm not sure it's an Omar, the man. Pass the thunder, develop. And that's the end of the first half. Very good first half for us. Nine shots on target to their three shots on target. And we have 60% position, so we just have. Beautiful, just four minutes. The combo. Oh, 
and that's the end of the game a good win for nil I'm very pleased So we managed to go up to 10th place with 17 points, which is very good. So that will bring us to the end of this episode. As we can see now we are in 10th place, 17 points on 16 matches. We will be back for the last game of the season against with another. I hope you enjoyed today's episode and until our next episode Saha.